from the students of Penn State Meteorology, here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. And good evening, everybody. Ryan Breton here from the Campus Weather Service with your Friday evening update. It's been a rather unsettled week of weather here in Pennsylvania, and today's been no different. We had a band of some showers move through this morning with some heavier downpours at times, but now we're seeing breaks in the clouds over a lot of western Pennsylvania. In fact, as we zoom in here on the satellite radar, just a few sprinkles in place here in central PA, and we have a lot of sunshine that's now developed on the other side of a cold front that's currently in western Pennsylvania. Take a look at Camp this right now. Uh, grass is turning green. That rain that we've had this week has certainly helped with that. And as we see some sunshine through the weekend, we'll continue to notice that things are going to green up here in Central PA. It's 54 right now in State College, 65 in Johnstown, 62 in Pittsburgh. These are the places that have seen the sunshine, but through a lot of eastern Pennsylvania, it's still rather cold. Temperatures in the 40s, anywhere from Williamsport down to the Capital Region and all the way into the Poconos as well. In terms of where we go from here, here, well, there's a lot of mild air down to our south in the 80s in Norfolk. Unfortunately, we're not going to get into this, but we will get into the drier air that is on the other side of this cold front. This warm front going to quickly move through here this evening, so we'll find a brief period with temperatures warming to near 60 over the next couple of hours. Then quickly behind that, the cold front comes through, and behind it, high pressure will build in for the weekend, but it will turn quite breezy at times during the day tomorrow, despite a lot of sunshine. So let's walk you through that here on future weather again. Clouds and showers move out this evening. It's a fairly quiet overnight. There could be a brief shower overnight, but overall we'll just notice some partly the mostly cloudy skies developing overnight into the early part of tomorrow morning. And then look at this. By 3 o'clock tomorrow afternoon, no clouds. And watch this. We'll advance the timestamp all the way through the day on Sunday. No clouds here on future weather. It's going to be a really sunny and delightful weekend. The best of 2015 so far here in central PA. No doubt about that. First things first, though, the forecast for tonight, varying amounts of clouds. A sprinkle or shower is possible, but most will stay dry with lows in the 30s. Tomorrow, we'll have some clouds during the morning, then we'll find increasing sunshine during the afternoon. Highs in the low to mid 50s, and there will be a gusty westerly breeze. Could gust as high as 25 or 30 miles per hour at times in a few locations. Great weather for Relay for Life this weekend. It will be a bit breezy tomorrow, as I mentioned, then quite cold tomorrow night. But Sunday, spectacular sunshine, temperatures in the lower, lower to perhaps even middle 60s at times on Sunday. So it looks like a great weekend if you're going to be at Relay for Life down at the Penn State track. Beyond that, we have a fairly pleasant week coming up. We'll find temperatures averaging above normal through much of next week. But then later next week, about a week from now, we do have some changes that we're going to be watching. There's going to be this area of high pressure offshore early in the week. By Wednesday and into Thursday especially, that will shift offshore and we'll begin to see a bit of a southeasterly flow develop. That will introduce moisture. Combine that with a cold front coming in from the west and there's a possibility that a storm will develop to the south and ride up along that front Friday into Saturday. Next Saturday is blue-white weekend, so there is a lot to watch. And if this does develop, it would have the potential to bring us a lot of rain late next week into the beginning of next weekend. It's not positive, but it's something that we're going to be watching over the next several days. Take a look at the seven-day forecast, though. A lot of good news, especially over the first five days there. Sunshine, 50s tomorrow, mid-60s, just beautiful. Probably the best day of the year so far on Sunday. Monday looks warm, temperatures near 70. Some showers will move through Monday night. It will turn cooler on Tuesday, and then it will remain quite similar here Wednesday into Thursday, temperatures in the 60s. And then we'd have to watch if any potential system would develop for the end of next week. But we have plenty of days to watch that, and we'll have updates for you all next week here on Campus Weather Service. Hope you have a great weekend. I'll see you back here Monday morning.